When you first install WM Recorder, it is set in auto record mode, which means that it will record automatically anything that you stream that it can capture. So for example, let me show you what I mean. So if I go to Options, Open Web Browser, and I click on Internet Explorer, which for me, it's the, it's the browser that WM Recorder works best with. I'm at YouTube. I'm going to type in The Beatles. I'm just going to click on a video and WM Recorder immediately starts capturing it. Now if I go back to the YouTube home page and I click on this ad, WM Recorder will start downloading that as well. If I click on this fall pumpkin patch video, WM Recorder will click on that, it will start recording that as well. Anything that plays either automatically or um, when I click on it, if WM Recorder can capture it, it will. So what I want to do is uh, go to Options. The very top item says Turn Auto Off. So I'm going to click on that and I'm going to turn Auto Off. Then, so that I have much better control over what I actually uh, download, I'm going to go to Options again and I'm going to change to List View, which is the second uh, item on the Options menu, a little pop-up window appears saying WMR set to list view. So I click OK. And then here is the list view. So this is, tells me all the streams that I've currently captured. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back to YouTube and type the Beatles. And this one I'll type yesterday. I click on the yesterday link. And, so the and the right away I received under my captured streams window a link to the YouTube yesterday video. If I want to record it, which I do, I highlight it and then I just click record and it immediately links and starts downloading. So basically what happens in this mode is that I have the option to pick and choose which videos I want to keep and which ones I don't. And that way I don't end up filling up my hard drive with a lot of stuff I don't want. If I want to go to the WM Recorder website, I just click on WMRecorder.com and here's the site. If I have any questions, I just can click on support. So thanks so much. I hope you enjoy the program. Bye-bye.